I was originally going to do this yesterday, but after seeing, well, um, Ralph breaks the internet, and, well, I don't know, catching a cold, I, I don't know, I got tired afterwards, and, ugh, somehow my cold started taking over, so, ugh, I just couldn't do it. But it's alright, because now I'm recovering, and also, I am sorry about my hair, I, I just got it done today, and, ugh, well, well, I don't know, it's just gonna be like this for a while, so, anyways, so, what did I think about the show, um, Pinky Malinky, you ask? Well, pretty much, pretty much, I think, I think you guys, I just could say, well, um, I don't really quite know, I mean, I think maybe it looked good, I mean, like, I'll just tell you ha, what, what wanted, what got me to watching it. Well, well, just one day I saw a, a video by Vale Ski Bum, and basically what, that it had now just been released on Netflix, even though it was originally supposed to air on Nickelodeon, and for some reason it still has the Nickelodeon logo on it on Netflix, which I don't know why it does, but hey, you know what, I'm guessing guessing it would still count as a Nicktoons saying because it, it still has the Nickelodeon logo on it. Let's, so we'll just put it that way. Wait, and besides, I love Nickelodeon, so I'm just gonna count, so it counts. And basically, well, I, and basically, pretty much after hearing about, after hearing about, I'm like, hmm, you know, I did just get Netflix on my iPad. I could watch it there. And when you know it, I thought, yeah, why not? Go and give it a try. Besides, I figured it would have been a good chance to, you know, maybe use it for once. I mean, the only time I used it was to watch a movie at the hotel that I was stuck in when we were having a pipe situation. In uh, having a pipe situation and all that. So, yeah. Now, this was pretty much, I gotta say, well, the first time I saw the trailer for it on Nickelodeon's YouTube channel, I actually thought, hmm, you know, this does kind of remind me of Gumball. You know, that show on Cartoon Network, which, which, I don't know, would people, would you consider this a ripoff of Gumball? I'm just curious. So, you know, and, well, 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 it was... I gotta say funny, but I didn't really watch all the episodes yet. I mean, I've, I've only gotten, I only, I stopped at like episode five and, you know, that was it. So, um, I think maybe I should talk about the characters. So, there's, um, there's Pinky, the main character, Babs, and JJ, along with the parents, who are both human, which is quite funny. I mean, a human couple... Having a, a a sausage, a talking sausage for a child. Uh, um, how did that even work out exactly? I mean, it's never really brought up, but hey. Hey, and um, there's also some other stuff, like characters, like some other characters. Like this one girl character who has, who I, who for some reason I guess has more than one job. I mean, in the first episode we saw her as a cashier, and then in another she's a dog catcher. I'm like, what? Ugh. Seriously. I, I just, I don't really know anything, like, what to say. Now, one thing I will say, because since, you know, I'm a fan of animated shows, I bet you all... Wondering, you know, Sumner, you're into voice acting. Were there any familiar voice actors you knew? Well, yes, but there were two. But the first, but one of them I knew was going to be in there, but he was always in live action shows, and this was probably his first time in an animated show. <laughs> and if you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm talking about Nathan Crest, who, who played JJ, who who, for some reason, I mean, he has a lot of tech, like, and that kind of made me think of another character he played on a live action show, you know, one that ran on Nickelodeon from, you know, 2007 to 2012. Can any of you guess? 
I bet you all can take a guess who I'm talking about. I mean, he was, he was, I mean, he was 14 when he played the role and, you know, somehow just, just, and somehow, I guess, changed throughout the series. So, yes. And so who was the second character? Well, the girl, well, the girl who has lots of, who had, I guess, more than one job was actually voiced by Greg Griffin. Yeah, for reals. Like, I read the, like, when I read the credits, I'm like, Greg Griffin. I'm like, hey, I know her. I'm like, because Dush, because Dush, she's in a lot, I've seen her in a lot of animated shows. And she's even in my favorite Nicktoons show. Like, what else do you expect? And maybe I should go about maybe talking about the, um, you know, how the show goes. Like, like pretty much they make it like a, there are moments where they make it like a reality show. Like they, like there's a moment where the characters are basically like sharing their thoughts on something. Like, like they're like doing this whole like reality show thing. Like where the, I guess, character is just like talking to the camera and saying what, like what they think. And there's even, well... Well, some moments, I guess, where they, I guess, film. And, I don't know, just be like those YouTuber people. Uh, I just, like, it just makes me, like, feel like, oh, boy. It's like I'm watching one of those popular YouTube, online YouTubers who make vlogs about their day-to-day -day lives or anything else besides that. Even though I don't really do that myself. I mean, I... I mean, I do, although I do attend to make videos of, you know, me, uh, you know, living my life with a bunch of Nicktoons and pony characters, that is. So, basically, you know, this show is just, well, a pretty much, well, you know, it's colorful, and, and, well, still kind of reminds me of Gumball, even though maybe... It may not be considered, I don't know, maybe it would or would not be considered a Nicktoon, but hey, it's alright. I mean, I mean, there, I know there are some, like, Nickelodeon shows that aren't really remembered by a lot of people that pretty much, when I look at those shows and people don't bring them up, I'm like, yeah, something tells me that show failed to be a Nicktoon. So, it obviously doesn't count as a Nicktoon, and I bet... Although, maybe some people could say the same for that, um, animated Henry Danger series. Oh, God. Odd. Like, once, like, people say, like, I know people don't really like that show, which I obviously don't. I mean, like, why would this even want to be a, why would anyone want to make this into a cartoon? It's already good enough as a live action show. But, yeah, you all know why. Just because of money. Because of money. Ugh. Ugh, always care, like, ugh, networks always caring about their money. <laughs> uh. But anyways, so, it's obviously, I gotta say, it was just okay. I mean, I didn't really feel too excited, and but I may give more a watch and some other stuff. And also, since I've been watching some Netflix shows, I bet you're wondering, will I be watching any more? Well... Well, I do watch My Little Pony on there, so, so maybe I might as well do that, do that as well. Like, like, I'm actually thinking, well, I know this series isn't really, didn't really get a lot of great reviews, but that I might give the series Disenchantment a, a watch because Simpsons was the only adult cartoon I was ever allowed to watch growing up. And finding out that it's done by the same person who did The Simpsons, I thought, yeah, why not? I'll give it a go. Yo, like, really. And besides, I'm old enough to watch a, watch cartoons that are made for adults now. Now, like, my mom, like, like, whenever my stepdad is watching Family Guy, my mom doesn't really care that, um, that I'm sometimes looking at the TV and... He sees him, and somehow she sees me, and she just, she's not really making those, she's not having those same reactions like she did back when I was really young. Oh, boy. So, I think that's all I gotta say about this series, and what's up? So, do I recommend it? Well, 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 whether you hate it or like it, I think, I think you would give it a try. I mean, it can't be all that bad, right? 
so yeah so anyways i think that's all i'm gonna say about this so see you guys later